Kiki, come on. It's taking too long to find a bathing suit. Wow. This conversation has been most enjoyable, but you still haven't told me why you're here. No, I didn't. Tell your boss I stopped by, Mr. Avery. I will do, Miss Jarrell. Perhaps our paths will cross again. Dr. Clay. How did chemo go? Um, well, I think uh, Danny's resting, so, so far, so, so good. But I think that's typical, right? I mean, it, it takes a while for the drugs to kick in. Was that not rhetorical? Yes, it takes a while for the side effects to set in. Anyway, I just, I wanted to say thank you. Because of you, I actually feel somewhat hopeful. I know, it sounds kind of crazy coming from me. Don't mention it. Mom, is Danny okay? Danny got through his first round of chemo like a champ. Not yet. Maybe not ever. Really? I didn't know that was even possible. Your uncle, believe it or not, swooped in and saved the day. Are you serious? Dr. Clay knows a chemo protocol that can decrease the side effects and even help the patient get well faster. That's amazing. And Silas just told you this, nothing in it for him? Oh, there's something in it for him. That man lives to be right. But if things go as we hope they will go, then we're gonna owe him a huge thanks. Wow, well, I will be diddly darned. Hey, kid, that uncle of yours just might have a heart after all. <laughs> oh, you know what, I should call Christina. She's been texting all morning. Good, Come give on. your sister my love. I will. So, so, what a great day. Yeah, so Lucy, thank you, because I have a wild guess that you had a talking to with Silas that appealed to his humanity? Uh, just not. Yeah, but I just am so glad I could be of help. Oh, uh, Sean stopped by. He was very, very concerned about you and Danny. Is that all he said? Yeah, but I, I got the distinct impression that something else was nagging him, something big. Well, <laughs> what the, hey, why did you tell me? You just happened. Hey, baby. Hey. 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 Oh, I'm okay. I'm out of it, but I think I'm gonna be okay. Yeah. yeah. Oh, baby's okay. No. It's not what it is now, but I didn't know what I was gonna do this time. I really didn't. You're stuck with me. It's good. It's good. You and that little grandbaby are here. You're stuck with me. He's a fighter, I told you that. Right, Dante? That's the best you can do. <laughs> not. Oh, you're so lovely. She's 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 too good and wonderful to die. Yeah, that too. Fighter. But the fighter part, that's that's been your best quality. I'm gonna go get the doctor. Thank you, honey. Thank you. Look at you. Is it possible you got even more handsome on it? Was that what? Hours and hours by your bedside and some Hail Marys and some vending machine coffees yeah. and uh a few bargains with God. Would you promise God? I made a bunch of deals while you were out. Promises I swore I'd keep, and I will. Yeah. First and foremost, finding out who did this to you. And it's on the case as we speak. You're going to turn yourself in? Are you out of your mind? Not really seeing another option. I do. Lots of them. Ones that don't include ruining both our lives. Look, it's the honorable thing to do, okay? The only thing if I have any chance of salvaging my relationship. Would you forget about Alexis? Sean, you can't do this. If you turn yourself in, it's a matter of time before Anna puts the pieces to me. 